All right, the night before, going to ride at area tomorrow, I gotta break out the 125 here, pull it out, make sure everything's good because it's been sitting for so long in the garage here. Before we get into it, I wanna thank Squarespace for sponsoring this video, which I'll talk about more at the end of the video, but I gotta do a run over on this thing, make sure it's good to go. Well, it's been a while since I've ridden the 125, going out to area today, open practice, and uh, should be fun. So I skipped all the boring loading part. We'll head out there, get unloaded. And uh, we'll get riding. Of course, we got the Tim Morton stop. It's been a while. We kitted up with coffee and donuts. We'll be all set. Comment if you've been on the channel for a while and you remember me coming here like almost every single video. It's been a while since I've rolled up here. I feel like it's been like two months, honestly, since I've ridden. I just got the bike unloaded here. Looks like Ryan brought his full trailer for one bike. <laughs> it's like it's huge. <laughs> All this for one bike. And, no, no, and the gear, and the gear. Crazy, so. We'll get this thing all warmed up, we'll get geared up, and then uh, we'll get the GoPro rolling. I don't know if I still remember how to ride this thing, to be honest, it's been so long. Probably gonna zip tie this up, it's like hanging out so far. My boot like snags it. Man, look at the Yamaha, Steve. Thanks, buddy. Whew. You got a couple fresh plastics, not all of them, but. We have some fresh graphics coming from AM soon. Freshen this thing up. Should be good. Whew. Look at these things. Haven't ridden in so long. There's cobwebs on all of my gear. <laughs> oh, it's so bad. Everybody likes to see this lecture on when I turn the fuel on. Fill up the bowl. This is the uh, their new H series Lectron. Um, I don't know. I think I rode the one ride on this thing, but this thing, uh, way better than the old Electron, way more responsive, like 30% better response. Can't go wrong with Electron on your two stroke. If you have a two stroke, you need Electron on your bike for sure. fun to ride regardless. I haven't ridden in so long, to be honest. Honestly, I feel like I barely rode the whole summer. I'm not gonna lie. I was saying, I think I'm having more fun on this track than the main Wait, track. Fun, dude. This right here. Oh, <laughs> Why, fall? No. Just sore? Yeah. You're gonna have to get mama to give you a little back massage or something. <laughs> you really can't kick it? I'm tired You're that tired? <laughs> Just hanging out. 
It's been so long since I've ridden this thing. It didn't take me too long to uh, get back used to it. But, but overall, fun, perfect day, can't complain. If you know, you know from future, not future, from past videos with these things. Waiting on a few more parts to come in from uh, Rocky Mountain. And then I'll probably finish this thing up. I got a bunch of parts just stacking up for it to do like another solid full build series video on it. And I'll get another, get a couple more parts on it. But I'm just trying to stack them all up so it's one, not a bunch of videos, just get one and done. loaded up ready to head out it's fun i'll just messing around for a little bit didn't get too much footage but sometimes just got a ride and i didn't really film anything but nonetheless had a good time it was fun good to finally ride that thing it's been so long i just got home got the bike unloaded i'm gonna come out tomorrow wash it up freshen everything up along with the e-bike that's still dirty all my stuff is dirty i'll cut into tomorrow doing that and then putting some parts on the crf all right let's get this thing all cleaned up washed up and put away like that got this thing all put away all cleaned up ready to go for the next time i ride it but like i said all the parts are coming in they all just got shipped hopefully start of november we'll have all the parts on in that video out aside from that might mess around on the 450 i'll wait for justin to come by go cruise around it's like a super nice day i feel like we're we're very limited on these nice days left where it's somewhat warm before uh, winter hits here and it'll be sled content i haven't touched this thing i haven't taken the cover off since uh I put it away. I probably should take it out and get a little run over. I know I need the skis and carbides for sure. Those things are flat from all the road riding I did. All right, so like I said in the beginning of the video, thank you to Squarespace for sponsoring this video. If you don't know what Squarespace is and you've been trying to make a website, Squarespace is the place for you because it's an all-in-one platform. If you're trying to open up your online store, have a website for your shop, Squarespace is definitely the place to go because it has all the marketing tools and analytics right on their website to get your business going right there. Because Squarespace is really just an all-in-one platform that really can just get your business started and it's really, really easy to do. I did it for my website. Squarespace has a bunch of different templates and things to choose from. Really cater to how you want your website set up and how you want it to look and how you want it to overall feel when somebody comes to your website. And really doing this when somebody first clicks on your website within like the first few seconds, you just gotta think about when you click on a website, how would you want it to look and how would you want it to feel when you're going to look and buy a product. You don't want it to be like too simple, but you want it to have a little bit of flavor and pictures and stuff of seeing the product that you're selling to really get somebody drawn in before they might click off your website if it's not super interesting. So they have all the templates right there ready to go that you can choose from. Along with that, if you don't already have a link for your website, you can just purchase the domain directly from Squarespace. Having all those templates already custom made just takes all the headache out and just makes it really simple to just pick a template, build your website on that, and not have to go through the hassle of trying to create a super modern website. Just having those templates just cuts out a lot of time for sure. Once you pick a template for your website, there's hundreds of customizable settings, fonts, colors, different pages you can choose from. So you definitely have a ton of different things you can do to it. Aside from designing your website, you can connect all your social media, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, directly on your site. So like I said, if you're trying to create your own custom website and get your business started online, you can go to squarespace.com for your free trial. And then once you're ready to build your online website, you can go to squarespace.com slash Tyler Monaghan for 10% off of your first website or domain. So once again, thank you to Squarespace for sponsoring this video. Close out the video here and get everything put away all cleaned up. All right, so that's pretty much gonna wrap this video up. I know a couple weeks ago, I uh, did a giveaway on my Instagram for a dango mount. I never actually picked a winner. So I'm gonna randomly scroll through here. 
on the Instagram post that most of you commented on. Scroll up and down, make it fair. And the winner is Torch, Torch 150A. I'll send you a DM and I'll get you shipped out your dangle mount. But aside from that, if you want to see more videos on the two stroke and the 125, make sure you subscribe, give this video a thumbs up, share it with your friends. If you want to see what's going down before the videos come out, you can follow me on Instagram, at Tyler Monaghan. And with that, I'll see you guys tomorrow in the next video.